always this isn't really good lighting or anything so it is a bit early it's, it's quite early morning so i do look a little bit clapped right now but that's all right camera's down anyway video is getting recorded anyway Let's look how the sun just shines on that anyway i just wanted to talk to you guys real quick about realistic fitness expectations i think a lot of people they get in the gym this was me included i did this so many times throughout high school you start exercising you start working out for maybe like a week and you expect to look like arnold schwarzenegger <laughs> like bro <laughs> if i could go back in time and do one thing it would just be to sit down with my younger self and just give him some kind of realistic expectations when it came to fitness. A lot of people, they go in the gym, they expect to just touch a dumbbell and look insanely jacked and lean at the same time within a week or a month. But guys, it just isn't like that. As a natural lifter, you're gonna have to love the process. You know, the grueling workouts. Fucking three hours that it takes to meal prep the first time. It actually took me four hours. I'm not a very good cook. But you get the point. And the main reason why this is happening, why a lot of people got like fucked up, realist, <laughs> fucked up fitness expectations, is because of things like men's health. I, I don't know what it's called. Men's health, GQ, all these like men's fitness magazines that are supposed to be you know helping men but in fact what they're doing is they're just fucking with your mental health they're showing you some guy's 30-day transformation where he's literally the day before taking the before picture he's gone and someone just wrote past the day before he's taking the before picture he's like going on a full-on like binge eat cheat day bloated the hell out of himself pushed his like stomach out and everything taking the before picture and within the 30 days he'll drop like maybe one or two percent body fat and then just before he takes the after picture he'll go on a one day water fast drain all his glycogen all his fluids and everything so that skin wraps really tightly around his muscles his abs and everything and then take that after picture and he'll post on instagram and everyone will be like, oh my god, did it do translation? And it's just, it's, it's kind of saddens me that a lot of young guys, they're watching this and they actually believe in this shit. But basically guys, the, the thing is this, as a natural, or even whether you're on gear or you're natural, it doesn't really matter, but you've got to love that process. Like, take this for example. The first month that I was kind of like getting into self-improvement consistently and everything, I expected in a deficit to be putting on like five, 10 kilos on the bar every week. That didn't end up happening and I felt like quitting. And I could have quit so many times because of that. I like, I'll be honest with you boys. I've literally been lifting the same weight for months now. It's not even funny, but it, it kind of saddens me sometimes. But I'm still doing it anyway because I've got that realistic fitness expectations. Like I know that the amount of muscle I put on on this cut is going to be very, very minimal. And it's going to be eight months of this shit. But after, bro, we're going to hit that first bulk and it's going to be good. And even then, I'm going to have realistic expectations when it comes to how much muscle I can put on, how much body fat is going to come on with alongside that muscle. Because obviously, we all wish we could bulk up and not put on like that little bit of body fat that you get. But it's not just, just not how the world works, is it? I wish, man, I wish. But yeah, if you're doing this, make sure you've got realistic expectations. Otherwise, you're just gonna be one of those people who does it for like a week or two and then quits early. Which is a shame because, you know, you wanna see what you're gonna look like when you're super lean, super jacked, and yeah, have realistic fitness expectations. I look fucking clapped under the sun, bro, legit. Not in my usual setup. 
But anyway, we're gonna hit a push workout today. Chest, shoulders, no triceps today. It's gonna be beautiful, bro. Let's get it.